Welcome to the 2015 Ramsey Happy Days Parade. We're here in downtown Ramsey on Sunwood Drive in front of the Ramsey Municipal Center. I'm Jim Steffen with Scott Siebert to commentate your parade this afternoon. Got a beautiful day of weather today. Should be a great parade. A lot of folks out here. Typical crowd. Streets are packed. A nice crowd. A lot of kids looking for candy. It's like an early Halloween for it these is. kids. It is. Leading off today is the Ramsey Police Department. Followed closely by the 7th Pennsylvania Regiment. They're going to kick things off today. Got a lot of, a lot of great floats that we'll see today coming through. Five mile an hour parade speed. Happy Days is an all day event here in the core. Started with a pancake breakfast and a 5K run this morning. Business Expo here behind us. Live music, fireworks tonight. If you're watching at home live, come on and out. Still plenty of seats available. There's the Ramsey Police Department leading the show here. You know, the 7th uh, Pennsylvania Regiment goes back to the Civil War time, organized back in 1862 in uh, Fort Snelling. Is that right? That's right. Bit of trivia, thank yes. you. Carrying today's colors. And there's our Ramsey City Council. Riding atop one of Ramsey Fire Department's tanker trucks is our City Council joined by their family. Mayor Sarah Stroman. Council members Jill Johns, Mark Kuzma, John Letourneau, Chris Riley, Melody Sherratt, Christine Williams, and City Administrator Kurt Ulrich. Looks like he's loading up the firearm here. Putting in the gunpowder. Showing off for our parade judges. Right. Just to their right. Full dress uniform. Here they go. Oh. Who's and ahs from the crowd. Very nice. It's impressive. It's a new addition, I believe, to our Happy Days Parade. That is. Nice to have them here. Way to fire things off. We'll observe a moment of silence. Nice reception from the crowd. The Ramsey City Council would like to thank everyone for coming out to the 2015 Happy Days Festival today. Well, they're packed tight up there. Yep. And the front is our mayor, Mayor Sarah candy. Stroman. Yep. Her husband, John. Looking good. Well, this is an interesting car, Scott. I, I've not seen this one around. I guess you get to choose your ride. I guess I'd go with the taxi. Right on. Coming up next, Ramsey EDA's Business of the Year, Alina Health Ramsey Clinic. Their 2015 Business of the Year and the Grand Marshal in today's Happy Days Parade. The doctors and staff members of Alina Health Ramsey Clinic have been caring for our community for more than 25 years. 
The clinic moved to its current location on Sunwood Drive in the core here in 2011. The clinic prides itself on fostering long-lasting relationships with patients. They are joined by the Alina Health Mobile Wellness Center van, which offers free health screenings at community events across the Twin Cities. Offering health screenings today for anybody who's interested on a Happy Days Parade. It's an impressive mobile unit there. It is. The Ramsey Economic Development Authority awarded their prize, their plaque, at the golf tournament last month. EDA board voted on them as the winner this year. Nice turnout. I assume doctors and nurses and staff and family all here to walk in the parade. Handing out candy or immunizations today? <laughs> <laughs> looks like... Band-Aids, maybe. Yeah, looks like Band-Aids. That's a good choice. Alinahealth.org. And here we have the Noka County Sheriff's Office. Sheriff's Office has a proud history since it was established on June 30th, 1857. They provide a wide variety of public safety and emergency services. What was that? Was that the boat? <laughs> Is that, that the, the airboat? I don't think that's the fan boat. No? No. Our sheriff is Sheriff Stewart. The sheriff is, a ch is our chief law enforcement officer for the county and is elected by the citizens of the county every four years. Throughout the 158-year history of the Nelka County Sheriff's Office, the duty of the sheriff has remained constant. He is the keeper of the county. And I love that airboat. It passed, it passed me once on the Rum River, and that is, that right? is a loud boat. <laughs> Making sure you were... Uh behaving yourself out there. Yes. Yeah. Sheriff Stewart was just recognized by the National Association of Sheriffs. He's one of the top sheriffs in the country. So congratulations to Sheriff Stewart for that Definitely. recognition. Definitely. Coburn's is a monster golf cart. Is that what's drowning out uh, <laughs> our voices? I, is think, the, I think we yeah. solved the mystery. Yeah. That's a monster golf cart of savings right now rolling into town accompanied by their classic character friends. Stop in after the parade, say hi to the rest of the characters that work there. And I shop at Coburn's quite a bit and there are a number of characters that work there. Great group of people. That is an impressive cart. I think they've souped up the engine since <laughs> last year. A little bit. Well, it takes a lot of horsepower to carry a macaroni and cheese box that size. <laughs> That is not 7.2 ounces. No. no. I'm not sure what character that is. Uh, it's, it's called that, Chocula. Uh, is it? I believe so. If not, he sure looks like him. <laughs> I love his ESPN draft analyst analysis. Here we have Storchak Cleaners along with Verily Tailoring. Storchak Cleaners and Verily's Tailoring boasts a 1954 delivery, which was used for delivering dry cleaning and tailoring back in the day. They have multiple locations, including 3193 Northdale Boulevard and Main Street in Coon Rapids. Also 1573 154th Avenue Northwest and Hanson Boulevard in Andover. Not to mention Highway 47 and Bunker Lake Boulevard in Ramsey. Thanks to store check cleaners and Vera Lee tailoring for being out here today. Northern Stars Children Theater is next. They're a fun and educational theater located in Ramsey. Northern Stars works with all kids, grades K through 12, to promote and encourage the love of theater arts. They put on four main shows a year along with having many educational theater classes to ensure kids are able to do what they love and love what they do. Northern Stars Children's Theater was awarded the 2015 Metropolitan Regional Art Council Community Art Grant for their production of Peter Pan this past spring. This is your place to shine. Great organization, Rachel Bonesack is their executive director. They put on great shows, typically right here in the core at Northgate Church. Here's Village Bank. Located here in Ramsey, among other locations throughout the county. 
We are Village Bank, or Bank at the Lake. Our theme is Up North Mobile Banking. I knew that they have a, an app you can download so you can bank anywhere you, anywhere you thank go. Thank you, Don. Don Quiton. Oh, thank you. Owner of Village. A lot of folks set up to their cabins, download their mobile app, do some banking while you're out on the lake. I did not. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Lots of gifts for, for the commentators from Village Bank. Essentials, Thanks, guys. Essentials of Life Chiropractic is next. A group of well, <coughs> excuse me, well-adjusted families representing the number one chiropractic clinic in Anoka County. Essentials, life, essentials of Life Chiropractic, helping families get well and stay well. Did you get that? Well-adjusted families? I did. Families? Very clever. Uh-huh. They do look well-adjusted. They do. Great posture on that float. Voted the number one chiropractic center for the last three years by Twin Cities Live. No sore backs in that group. Nope. Family Speech and Therapy Services. For 11 years, Family Speech and Therapy Services has provided the highest quality speech and occupational therapy to help children and adults with deficits in communication, fine and gross motor or sensory skills reach their fullest potential. Located in Ramsey as well, right off Highway 10. FamilySpeech.com, their website. Nice little uh, Cooper, Cooper convertible. Looks like we have some some fun coming down next. Pro Power Sport Marine. It's your one-stop shop for fun year-round. Products are from well-known brands like Can-Am, Ski-Doo, Sea-Doo, Polaris, and Suzuki. Pro Power Sports and Marine is an award-winning sales and service with a 35,000-foot show floor. Wow. Special thanks to Wally McCarthy and Buick GMC for the use of their fine GMC truck today. The McCarthy Auto World Buick. Uh, Denali pulling that impressive looking float there. If they could just back that whole rig in my garage, I'd be set. Could have a little bit of fun with the equipment on the back of that. Fun stuff. Citywide service, towing service, located in Brooklyn Park, Ramsey, Spring Lake Park. That does not look as fun. That's not good. What they're Mad. Pulling. Mothers against drunk driving. Ouch. Yeah, they're towing, impounding, and storage. That's another reason to take the taxi. Yes, exactly. Great reminder there. The Inoka Twisters dance team. Proudly led by their captains Natalie Strike, Eric Johnson, Aaron Johnson, sorry, Morgan Winhurst, and Jordan Willenbring. Their coaches are Ben Madrigal and Tessa Madrigal. I'd say that's the loudest float so far. Yep, yes it is. Halloween parade dates, it's coming up. Light up the night parade, October 24th, and of course the Grand Day Parade on Halloween. A little bit of, little bit of a gap here before our next float. Again, a beautiful day out here today. Lots of folks lining the streets. A little bit of candy so far for the, the little ones out here. They're all eagerly awaiting more. I think there's usually a dentist that comes through with some toothpaste too, just to even <laughs> things out, so. <laughs> You'll rarely see the dentist throw candy. Although it could be good for business. A lot of little kids here, as we mentioned. 
Well, this is the trailer of the Anoka Twister dance team. I guess I've already mentioned them, haven't I? Yeah, the, the double. The double float. They had the walkers, now the dancers. I'm sure they were out at the big Anoka Andover football game last night. Definitely. Nice win for the Anoka High School football team. My alma mater a couple of years ago. Like 28. <laughs> I wasn't going to say. No, okay. I was thinking more of the... And we mentioned the 1800s with the Civil War early on, the revolutionary <laughs> timing. <laughs> wow. Great showing by the Twisters today. Lots of dancers. A Solid Waste. Carts on Parade is an A Solid Waste community outreach program that promotes environmental awareness and recycling by engaging local community groups in a cart decorating contest and cart brigades. A cash donation is made to the group for their efforts. The performing group today is the Ramsey Police Explorers. As a business that has been servicing the local area since 1955, we hope these programs improve our community and support organizations that are important to all of us. I see a minion. You see a minion. I did, the lead garbage can looks like a minion. Oh yeah. Got some popcorn. There's a Vikings cart. Who would have thought you could have so much fun with garbage cans? Right. And these are all our Ramsey Police Explorers. That is an organization put on by the Ramsey Police Department. Young people interested in a career in law enforcement, perhaps? Just for Kicks is next. They offer dance classes for ages 3rd through 12th grade. Classes in Champlin offer proven technical training, a focus on teamwork, and a respectful experience for the dancers. The teaching environment is low stress with a balance of fun and technique. The Champlin Just for Kicks director recently won the Developing Director of the Year. The Just for Kicks, your dancer will shine. They start them young, don't they? They do. Get They're going to perform for our camera here. Get them involved at an early age, all kinds of activities. Next up, we have the Learning Lodge. Voted 2015 Best of the Best. The Learning Lodge is a unique child care center providing care for families with children six weeks to 12 years their experience in nurturing teachers along with their fresh and healthy meals made from scratch promote important growth in all areas during the first crucial years of life you can check them out at the learning lodge in ramsey.com or stop by for more information that's an impressive looking lodge and that's, that's pretty much what their building looks like, just <laughs> much bigger. <laughs> right on Highway 5 in Ramsey. Next up, we have the Anoka High School Cheerleaders. The Anoka Cheer Team cheers at Anoka High School football, soccer, hockey, and basketball games, along with competing at local competitions throughout the year. Cheerleaders are coached by Lindsey Murray, and Colleen Benz. Ready. Here they go. Good game last night at Goodrich Field. Definitely. Yeah. An impressive win, and I, I believe the Anoka High School cheerleaders were there. I'm sure. Getting people fired up.
More dancers. Here we have the Vogue Dance Company. It's a small family oriented studio with a big studio work ethic. Dynamic and dream. They offer classes for dancers from age three to 18 in both competition and recreational lines. They have an incredibly successful competition season, earning many first place wins, studio and judges awards, including six awards for best choreography. Vogue Dance Company is a studio where the dancers are challenged, balanced, passionate, and most of all loved. If you love to dance, we want you to be part of our dance family. We're located at Andover, off Round Lake Boulevard, Check them out on Facebook or on the web at VogueDanceCompany.com. Did you say age three? I did. Three wow. to 18. They start dancing at a very young age. Yes, they do. That's great. Your daughter did some dance, I would imagine. She did. Yeah. I believe she was five when she started. Kind of cool how the three-year-olds dance with the 18-year-olds. That's right. Next up is Jet's Pizza. They're located in Anoka on Round Lake Boulevard and Bunker Lake Boulevard. Jet's is open for lunch and delivers. Life is short, eat better pizza. And this is something that I learn. I learn something every year. I didn't realize we had a Jet's Pizza here. You know, I didn't either. They make a killer barbecue pizza. Round Lake barbecue and chicken. Lake. Yeah. yeah. I would recommend the barbecue chicken. Really? Go for that? Very good. Not sure the name of the mascot there. Jet. I would let's just go with Jet. So let's go with Jet. I like it. Next up is Custom Remodelers, CRI. is a family-owned business and has been proudly serving Minnesota and Western Wisconsin for the past 26 years. Siding, roofing, windows, gutters. There's always something to do around the house. Something to fix or add on. Custom Remodelers, give them a call. First Choice Towing is next. First Choice Towing and Recovery would like to thank the community for all of their support in making us the area's fastest growing towing company. They would also like to thank you in advance for continuing support. Make them your first call from towing your classic car, motorcycle, or bigger to toys like motorhomes. They can handle it all. It's one of those things you hope you never need, but when you do, it's good to know. That's right. Good to have a number ready. Lots of chrome and extra shiny on parade day. Yes. Good looking trucks. Looks like they brought out a couple of their vehicles. Choice towing. Next up is the Braven Music School with instructor Barry Cole. Rocking out with his son Grant on guitar and his band, the Honey Badgers. Special thanks to First Choice Towing for pulling the band this year. Raven Music School offers a rock band and individual lessons in guitar, drums, bass, voice, piano, and don't forget the ukulele. First lesson's free. Give them a call, 763-571-9694. Not a lot of places that offer ukulele no, lessons. No, no. They cover it all. 
Let's see what their next song is. One, two, one, two, three. Hit it. Name that one, tune, Scott. Two, three, four. Hi, the tiger. I know. Oh, nice. You beat me to it. Should get some crowd participation of that song. Yeah, the dual drummers in the back. Yeah. Looks like up next we have Cub Scout Pack 623. Pack 623 is a Cub Scout Pack unit chartered by Lord of Life Church in Ramsey. Pack has been helping young boys learn lifelong skills for over 13 years. They have monthly meetings where they participate in different activities such as Feed My Starving Children, Ice Cream Social, Toys for Tots, Snow Days Camp, and Pinewood Derby. This pack also helps our local community by helping to clean up Rivers Bend Park, participating in the annual Scouting for Food, where the food is donated to ACBC Food Shelf. Here we have Northgate Church. Northgate Church loves Ramsey and is the sponsor of the Inflatables and the Kids Activity Tent. Just behind us here at Happy Days, check them out. Northgate's located uh, right up the street here, Sunwood Drive in the core. Join them on Saturdays at five or Sundays at nine and 11. Rockin' music, inspiring messages, awesome program for kids, youth, and adults. Don't miss their Halloween Fun Fest on Halloween from six to nine. Bring your bags back to that event and fill them with lots of candy and prizes. It is a happy day. I have some bonus candy for anybody who makes someone's day today. If I see someone, give someone a hug. I have some bonus candy. Give someone a hug. Bonus give candy. Give someone a hug. Well, the wireless mic is a hit. <laughs> Thank you. We'll visit by one of the North Gators. Next up, Northern Stars Girl Scouts Council. Northern Stars Girl Scouts sharing the mission to build girls of courage, confidence, and character who make the world a better place. Their work is supported by volunteers. They provide an inclusive environment where girls develop the skills they need to become future leaders. Through specialized programs and events, they provide a safe place for girls to grow and share new experiences, develop core values, and contribute to society. At Girl Scouts, Cub Scouts, great organizations. Yep. Another dance team. Studio One Dance has been teaching dancers in the Anoka Ramsey area for 11 plus years. Their performing lines have award-winning choreography, grand championships, scholarships, and more. They look forward to teaching all their dancers the art and joy of dance, as well as teamwork, respect, and individuality to share their gifts. Sign up at Studio One Dance today. There's a lot of dance studios there are in Ramsey and Anoka. And they all have a lot of participants, a lot of dancers. Very popular. Coming down next, Koru Fitness, or not. Is that the Independent Baptist Church? It is. It is. We were told they were out today, but they must have snuck into the lineup. It says here their annual tent meetings are September 17th through the 20th at 7 p.m. Independent Baptist Church celebrated its 25th anniversary last year. They're a growing church that has a passion for God, His Word, and people. They're excited about what God is doing and through the people of IBC. Independent Baptist Church. Okay, 
here's Karu Fitness. Located in Ramsey, Koru Fitness and Personal Training offers over 40 group fitness classes per week. Private, semi-private, small group training, nutritional coaching, and caters to all fitness levels. The Kickstart program gets you a noticeable increase in energy and loss of inches in 24 days. Koru opened in January 2013 and is owned by a wife and mother who wanted to make a bigger difference in the lives of other people. That's Nicole Cutches. It's time for a change. Get your free pass today. You know, after a Jets pizza, talk to the people at Coral Fitness. They'll take care of you. Right. I've been there. I've worked out with these guys. It's a good place. In fact, there's my instructor right there, Anna, mic'd up. Next up, Alpine Dog Park. They're located here in Ramsey at Alpine Park, where dog enthusiasts can bring out their pups to run free in a five-acre fenced play area. Come meet great people and pups. Join them on Facebook at Ramsey Dog Park Alpine Drive to learn more about their fun activities like the Wiener Dog Roast, Dog Days at Saints Game, Puppy Bowl, and other great events. Right out there between the baseball fields at Alpine Park in Ramsey. Yep, right near Central. And there's always dogs there. It's a popular... Popular dog park. You know, and you can hear the dogs wailing from a certain distance. Can you? <laughs> well, that's a nice transition Perfect into uh, Whalen for House. Representative Abigail Whalen just completed her first term serving Anoka and Ramsey in the legislature. Prior to election, Whalen earned her master's in public policy and worked in the Minnesota Senate. When asked about her first term, Waylon replies that through that though like any job, it has its ups and downs, she enjoys it and is grateful for the opportunity to serve. I would say that truck is strewn with bumper stickers. Strewn, yes. Not necessarily on the bumper. That is a Waylon vehicle. A lot of her supporters. There's Abigail there. Up next, we have Pack Charter School, home of the Panthers, represented by members of the student council and dance team. The Pantherettes competed at the state dance competition for the last two years. They are proud to be Panthers. I think this is number five or six for dance groups Panthers. here today. I think you're right. Put on a great show for the, the crowds that have assembled here today. So the Pack Pantherettes dance team, the first sports team from Pack to compete at the state tournament level, made their first trip to state to the state finals of the high kick division last year. Pantherettes are coached by Aaron Krusey, a Ramsey native, and Kelsey Field, also from Ramsey. Creative Kids Academy has provided quality, nurturing, and affordable child care since 1997. We are proudly NAEYC and Parent Aware accredited. Their primary focus is providing the best care possible for your child with creative learning in mind. We enable and encourage each child to reach their full potential by promoting trust, education, nurturing, creativity, safety, health, and social responsibility. We believe early childhood education is the foundation for success. Coming up next, the Anoka Ramsey Athletic Association being led by their 12U Gopher State Championship Baseball team, coached by Josh Sumner. Great job this year, boys. 
ARAA is an all-volunteer athletic association established in 1979 to provide the youth of Ramsey, Anoka, and the surrounding community with guidance, equipment, and fields in baseball, basketball, football, lacrosse, soccer, softball, tennis, volleyball, and wrestling. I think they're proud of their own poster with their faces on it. That's that something awesome. every baseball team should have. Oh, that's awesome. Now they had a great season. Congratulations to that team. Got the Anoka Youth Wrestling here as well. That's right. The youth, re youth Wrestling sign up. Registration will be opening soon. Lots of kids on the float, including a few of mine. My beautiful wife, daughter, two sons, handing out candy. Great organization. Lots of lots of kids in the program. ARsports.org. Next up, we have Hope Fellowship. You are wanted at Hope Fellowship. Hope's located on 167th Avenue in Ramsey, just kitty corner from the Rum River Hills Golf Course. Our theme this year is Wanted. The Western Town Float was built by the Hope Fellowship Youth Group and Corey DeLuca and Bill Peters. That's an impressive looking float there. They worked hard on that. It's nice to see every church and every dance studio out right. here in the parade today. Very well represented. They got the Old Town Saloon, Motel, Sheriff's Office. The Wanted theme. You are wanted. At your best, at your worst, and everything in between. Next up. The Sulem Grotto Clowns, as with, as with most Masonic organizations, the Grottos of North America participates in philanthropic work with children. Their particular area of concern is with providing dentistry for special needs children and funding for cerebral palsy research. Many of their functions combine fun activities with the serious business of fundraising for the charity, the Humanitarian Foundation of the Grottos of North America. When the award-winning Sulem Grotto Clowns are not doing parades, you can find them visiting hospitals, participating in community events. Their motto is to put a smile on every child's face, regardless of their age. North Star Towing. Proudly celebrating 40 years of service. Their experienced, friendly, and efficient staff is here to help you out of any situation 24-7. Their drivers, along with uh, their continuously growing fleet of 16 trucks of all sizes, work hard to give you fast and efficient service year-round. Northstar proudly received the Anoka County Reader's Choice Award for favorite towing company the past three consecutive years and strives to continue offering A-plus service to our communities. Make them your only call for all your towing needs from your everyday vehicle to heavy equipment. Looks like a dragster on the back of that one. It does. It's got a parachute. And if you need that truck, you get serious, serious trouble. That could tow wow. just about anything. I might be able to move City Hall with that guy. Right. There's that race car, drag racer. Next up, Northern Light Church. Roll up to Northern Light Church this Sunday morning. They're a church that's all about having fun, making a difference, and discovering faith together in their casual welcoming service every Sunday morning at 10 a.m. Find out more at northernlightchurch.us. Like and share our Facebook page today, only for your chance to win a youth bicycle or power wheels. Northern Light Church.
lots of purple out there. And a lot of all folks. the ICs they're handing out. Well, there we go. Perfect day for an icy. No one's going to offer us one, though. State no. Farm. The Better State crew is here today with local State Farm agent Mike Orn. Mike's a Ramsey resident. He's sponsored and run the Happy Days Car Show for five years. For almost a century, State Farm has been committed to being a good neighbor, whether it's through insurance or helping out the community. State Farm and the Better State crew is here to get you a better, get you to a better state. Call Mike's office today for a free auto quote. 763-323-4101 or get a quote online at mikeorn.com and if you're walking around happy days after the parade be sure to stop by the state farm booth they're giving away a $500 visa gift card so stop by and enter to win today thanks Mike for having all your folks and your agency out here and helping with the car show for so many years they got the good neighbor on the back of that Truck. Uh -huh, I get that. Good neighbor. For those of you on Twitter, hashtag Better State Crew MPLS. We are moving right along today's Happy Days Parade. Coming down to the home stretch, I believe. The Anoka Hennepin School District is next. Their float features a little country schoolhouse reminiscent of their beginnings. The 13 communities in the district were dotted with small schoolhouses from the mid-1800s into the 20th century. 1952, 31 small districts, dis, districts consolidated into the Anoka Hennepin School District, now the largest in the state, serving 39,000 students and preparing students for a future without limit. Three of those 39,000 are in my family. That's right. Part of the school district. A couple uh, school board members here, Tom Heideman and Bill Fields. His son, Ivan, I recognize. Noble Romans, take and bake pizza. The parade ends at Noble Romans, just down Sudwood. Located across from Colburn's, they're local veteran-owned and working hard to be your favorite neighborhood pizza place. They use 100% real meats and cheeses, no soy fillers, fresh toppings, and their doughs are fantastic. They also have gluten-free pizza. Your pizzas come on an aluminum tray, no chemically treated platters, ready for your oven or grill. You'll love their pizza and everyday low prices. Right behind, the Anoka Area Hockey Association. They're accepting registrations at this time. If you're interested, get onto anoka.pucksystem2.com, their website. We'll see if maybe next year we can't get some ice down the middle of right. Sunwood Drive here. They can that. use real skates. I think this is a no checking parade. Right. The Anoka Area Hockey Association. <laughs> Bob FM. Bob U. Lance is Bob FM M's parade vehicle of choice. Bob FM's home is right in your backyard. Here at Ramsey, Bob FM plays country music covering all your favorites, including the biggest country hits of all time. You won't hear anywhere else. If you're looking for music, you can sing along on the way home. Enjoy the parade, and if you're on your way home, punch in to 106.1 Bob FM. You can't have a parade without a Bobby Lentz. Do the Bob.com. Oh, there they go. You can hear a little bit of country music underneath the sirens there from the Bobby Lentz. I just like saying Bobby Lentz. Bobby Lentz. I think I missed that. Bobby Lentz. Bobby Lentz. Bobby Lentz. 
Freedom Church is next. Freedom Church, come in for an upbeat and relevant Sunday service. They're located just on Highway 10. Website freedomcc.org. Well, when you hear the siren, you know you're just about done. Ramsey Fire Department. We got the ladder truck coming down Sunwood. Ramsey Fire Department featuring some of its impressive fire trucks and equipment. Joined by our chief, Dean Kepler, and his grandchildren riding along on the ATV. Always impressive, that ladder truck. Lots of kids up there. Here's our chief, Dean Kapler. His grandson sitting next to him. Several volunteer firefighters and their families. Want to thank these guys for keeping us safe 24 7. Absolutely. There they are. There's a little fire chief in the passenger seat. Chief in training. How high do you think that ladder goes? Um, to the top of the residence of the core. Is that right? Just behind us here, I'd say three, four stories. I'm glad we don't use it that often. Right on. more firemen in training there. That's right. Always an impressive showing. Ramsey Fire Department. They bring out all the vehicles every year. There's our Zodiac boat for service on our two rivers. The rub on the Mississippi, of course. Seven vehicles. I'm, I'm hoping there's no fires in the town and city right now because they're all busy. We get all the the tow, the tow trucks, the fire trucks, all in one location here. We have a beautiful new fire station under construction right now. Right on Alpine Drive will be fire station number two. This guy's riding easy in the back of that boat. Oh, they just keep coming. They've been cleaning their vehicles as much as the tow truck companies. And lots of nice chrome. Not a spot of dirt. Well, there we are. There we are. It's been fun, Scott. <laughs> It's our second year doing this. Absolutely, another great year, great parade. Hopefully QCTV and the city will have us back next year. Always enjoy it. A close up shot. Great way to end today's parade. Sure. 
Shortly after the parade wraps up, we'll have a country band performing here on Sunwood Drive and the other country band tonight on the main stage. Fireworks at nine. Connections Church helping out with the cleanup here, the last of the parade. They've been serving the city of Ramsey for five years. They believe Jesus did not come to be served, but to serve, and they want to reflect that as they pick up trash every year at the Happy Days Parade. Come check out Connections Church tomorrow at 9.30 or 11 a.m. for a fun morning with comedian Jerry Frazier at Ramsey Elementary School. If there's any candy left on the street, Connections Church will get it. That's right. Well, that does it today, Scott. It's a great day here at Ramsey for the Happy Days Parade. We want to thank you for watching QCTV today. For more local programming, go to QCTV.org. QCTV brings you high school sports, including football, volleyball, soccer. QTCV is your source for what is happening in your community. You can see city meetings and District 11 school board meetings. Find out what is happening in Anoka, Andover, Champlin, and Ramsey. Great parade today. I want to thank all of our QCTV folks, our cameramen, our crew, Taylor inside the truck. It's been fun. Absolutely. Let's do it again next year. Sounds good. Thanks, Scott. Thank you, Jim.